What's going on guys, I am the Walrus Jedi, and in today's video I have another Clone Wars review. This time it is Season 2, Episodes 9 through 11. They are Grievous Intrigue, The Deserter, and Lightsaber Lost. If you like these Clone Wars reviews and would like to see more, then consider liking and subscribing and hitting the notification bell for more videos in the future. There will be spoilers for these three episodes, so consider that your warning. Cast of the episodes, Matt Lanter, Anakin Skywalker, James Arnold Taylor, Obi-Wan Kenobi and Plo Koon, Matthew Wood, General Grievous and the Battle Droids, D. Bradley Baker, the Clone Troopers, Chris Edgerly, Eth Koth, Angelique Perrin, Adi Gallia, Tom Kane, Narrator, Yoda and Yolaren, Nika Futterman is Shaiya, Kara Pifko is Sue, Kath Susi is Jack, Ashley Eckstein is Ahsoka Tano, Greg Baldwin is Tara Sanube, Flo De Ray is Jocasta New, Meredith Salinger is Ioni Marcy, and Jamie King is Cassie Cryer. Episode 9, Grievous Intrigued, which aired January 1st, 2010, on Cartoon Network. It's directed by Giancarlo Volpe and written by Ben Edlund. The moral is, for everything you gain, you lose something else. Grievous captures Zabrik Jedi Master and Council Member Eth Koth near Seleucami. The General sends the Jedi a message taunting them. Eth Koth sends a message via hand signals so they know where to go. Obi-Wan, Anakin, and Master Adiagalia go to Seleucami. Obi-Wan engages with Grievous while Anakin and Adi rescue Koth. Grievous flees and boards the landing craft for the invasion of Seleucami, but his ship is damaged and he crashes on Seleucami. There's also uh, a couple of lightsaber fights in that episode. You've got Grievous versus Eth Koth, and then Obi-Wan versus General Grievous. 10. The Deserter, which aired January 1st, 2010 on Cartoon Network, directed by Robert Dalva and written by Carl Ellsworth. The moral is... It is the quest for honor that makes one honorable. Obi-Wan hunts Grievous on Seleucami. Rex is shot by a droid sniper and he is taken to a local farmer's house to heal. This farmer is a clone deserter, Cut Laquane. Some commando droids attack the homestead and Cut and Rex fend them off. Grievous escapes just as Kenobi finds him, but they do have a brief duel. And Rex leaves the farmer's house and rejoins the Republic. And that's where that ends. 11. Lightsaber Lost, which aired January 22, 2010, on Cartoon Network. It was directed by Giancarlo Volpe and written by Drew Z. Greenberg. The moral is, easy isn't always simple. Whilst going after a scumbag in the bowels of the Coruscant underworld, Ahsoka Tano has her lightsaber stolen by a pickpocket. Once back at the temple, she goes to the library and asks Jocasta Nu for help. She directs Ahsoka to Master Tara Sinube, an expert on the Coruscant criminal world. They identify the thief and go to where he is. He reveals he sold it to a Trandoshan criminal. The two Jedi go to this criminal's house, only to find him dead and his distraught girlfriend. Ahsoka finds the saber thief in another room, but the thief flees and Ahsoka pursues. The distraught girlfriend flees after Sunube continues to dig, and he tracks her and follows her. The two scumbags are apprehended at the train station, and Ahsoka gets her lightsaber back and goes and teaches a lesson on patience, which she learned in this episode, to the younglings. What I liked. For Grievous Intrigue, it's cool to see Eth Koth you know, to continue fleshing out these other characters, Jedi Masters and things like that. It's always nice to see different characters. For the Deserter, uh, it's cool to see Seleucami, which is the planet from Revenge of the Sith where the Jedi on the uh, speeder bike gets shot out. I believe that's Stas Ali. Yeah. And uh, we see Reeks in this episode again. And... Uh, Arik is one of the creatures in the Geonosian arena. It's the one that Anakin had to deal with. For Lightsaber Lost, uh, Terra Sanube is kind of a fun character. 
And then for what I didn't like, for Grievous Intrigue, I think Ethkoth should have died at, at Grievous's hand just to kind of show Grievous is really a Jedi killer. He, we don't see that really in this show, so that's unfortunate. For the Deserter, I don't know if there should be a clone Deserter. That I don't know if that makes sense with the chips and everything, because that's just what I was thinking. It's like, and then for Lightsaber Lost, there are several occasions where Ahsoka could have just used the Force to get her lightsaber back, but didn't and I, I noticed that that happens a lot in this show when it's like oh you can just use the force to do this to pull something or you know whatever but they have a tendency to not to well i'd give these episodes the ratings as follows for grievous intrigue 7.5 out of 10 the deserter 6.5 out of 10 and lightsaber lost 5 out of 10 not the worst batch of episodes, but not the best. So I guess uh, I guess you could say average. So you can let me know what you thought of these three episodes in the comment section down below. Which one did you enjoy the most? Right now you can watch my uh, second battle of Geonosis arc review on the top left. And on the bottom left is the season two episodes one to four review. As Cat Bane taking a holocron and all that. So, enjoy those if you would like. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed, and until next time, thanks for watching.